What's up guys, it's your boy here, and I'm, today I have a little different video with Black Ops 3. A lot of people have been asking me, how do I set up to do trick shots and trick shot battles and stuff. So uh, today I'm going to be showing you, as you probably saw in the title, how to set that up and what you need to do, okay? So first you're going to go to set up game. For change map, I suggest fringe because there's a lot of good spots to hit shots. But you can go to whichever map you want, I'm going to show you on fringe today. You want to go to capture the flag, and then you want to change you want to change the win rule to total flag captures, and then time limit to unlimited, and how or how long you want to do. And capture limit unlimited, round limit round limit unlimited, round win limit. You don't need to change that. Enemy character. This is important, so you'll see later that this is very important. So you want to turn that to disabled. And then auto return time, that's important too. You want to put that on limited. And then capture condition, that doesn't matter. Pick up time, instant, return time disabled. So if you, you can pause your screen right now to change all those if you want. So three, two, one. For general, there's nothing really you want to do. You don't have to turn on constant, but I just like doing that on the mini map. And then respawn delay, that, it'll be very annoying if you don't turn that off. So. I, I forget that sometimes and I get mad at myself. So on health and damage, you want to go to health and do 65% so you don't get, there's a, there's a bigger chance of not getting any hit markers. And then you don't need to hit, you don't need to change it. Oh yeah, you need to, you can change the health regeneration to fast if you want to, you don't have to though. Competitive, there's really nothing except for down here, item bans. To make it easier so they won't kill you all the time, you can go, you can ban everything but the snipers. So, you can just do this real quick, like that, and then you can ban whichever snipers you're not going to use, or you, or you just don't ban any of them, I just don't ban any of them, and then you want to ban all these, and if, if you want to, you may want to, okay. and then equipment, you don't really have to ban any of those, and then the rest are good. Create a class, this is important too, if you want to have a good class, go to 17 selections allowed. That's what I do. Okay. And then for setup bots, I usually do it on Black Ops for about maybe like 11. So there's not too much, but there's still enough to have a bigger chance. My, here's my classes. I have the Locust, Computer, Ballistic CPU, and Rapid Fire on that. And this VG, I just have it. No attachments. And then I have Shock Charge and then that. And then this one is my cool one. This is the Draken with thermal, FMJ, and stock, and then I have the SVG, and then the black hat. So I'm going to show you where the best place to put it is, or in my opinion, the best flag, so you can put it where you want to trick shot. So let me just go really quick. And none of them, I suggest going around the back, because none of them will come this way. I've figured that out. And then make sure you don't get killed on your way there. Which I'm about to be. Oh no. Yeah. That's good enough. That's a good place. And so now, they're, since you turned off enemy flag carrier, they won't. Um, oh my god, I'm trash. They won't. Um, what am I going to say? They won't um, take the flag. So they'll just huddle around it. And so you can put it wherever you want. I like this spot on fringe. And I'm too trash to go for a shot right now but I hope this was helpful to you and I am going to stick in a clip of a jump shot that I found on aquarium the other day and um hope you like that and